Okay guys, it's movie night and you know the routine. I get to pick a movie, I get to do my reviews and you guys can go check it out if you like what I said about it, all right? So kick your feet up, get comfortable and let's go. Okay guys, welcome back once again to DJ Pablo TV. I'm your host Paul, aka DJ Pablo and Tonight's movie is called Darkest Hour and it's based off World War II and the British and mainly around the life of Prime Minister Winston Churchill and the struggles that the British people had to go through during the World, the world War II era and it, it's a pretty good movie guys, I like the whole setting of it, I like the way they did the storyline and it shows how a real strong president can really take charge of his country and motivate them in a time of need or in a time of war. So I'm saying the British were this close to surrendering and I didn't know that part about the whole history of it. And Churchill actually went out on the subway by himself. Something like I can't even think of a president here doing something like that. But Churchill actually went into the subway and he was driving on the train and he decided to ask the people themselves what would they think if the British were right, if the Germans were right on the shores of England and would it be a good idea if maybe they negotiated them to probably do a surrender and the people on the train were like no way, no way, hell no, so what I'm saying? So that idea, he took that and decided you know what, I know exactly what to do man, no matter what happens we are going to fight to the end and we are never going to surrender. So he went back to his parliament and delivered one of the most powerful speeches in history and motivated the British people to victory and they decided they would never surrender no matter what happens. The thought of having the German flag flying over Buckingham Palace was like a nightmare to him. So he was like, no way they're gonna surrender. So I'm saying guys, so it's a pretty good movie, man. I don't wanna spoil it for you. I want you guys to really go check it out on your own. It's available now on HBO, they're running it. So you can probably look it up if you have HBO or maybe you can probably try to find it in Netflix. I'm not sure if it's on Netflix yet because I didn't go and look. I saw it on HBO so I decided I'm going to work with it from that side. So it's a pretty good movie guys as I said. It's called Darkest Hour and it's based off World War II, the whole Nazi Germany invasion stuff. With them taking all over, taking over Europe and just going from country to country and every minute you hear they take another country. They were on France and... It's really telling you about some of the history of what happened, especially with the guys who were at Dunkirk on the shores of France, the struggles they had to go through and how the British actually sent civilians to go help out to get some of them and bring them back over to England. So what I'm saying? So with that said, guys, I'm just going to wrap it up, man. It's a short, short show. You know, movie night, we don't really go too long. It's just to kind of give you something to go watch, just to give you a little bit of entertainment info so that way if you're bored you're home you haven't watched a movie in a long time maybe you can go check it out and see if it's entertaining for you all right so with that said let me just wrap it up by saying if you're brand new make sure you hit the subscriber button make sure you hit the notification bell and for my regular subscribers thank you guys for always being here with me and the usual peace and salute from west palm beach and i'm out of here and i will see you guys tomorrow and i gotta go to work so let me wrap this up I might get on the drum machine tomorrow again, but I, as I said, I don't want to show you what I'm doing because I got a special beat that's coming up and I'm planning to reveal that beat on my first anniversary here on YouTube, all right? So with that said, guys, see you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.